Hi everyone, my name is Ju. If you are new to the channel, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Today I'm here in Toyota Global City. If you want to purchase Toyota vehicles, please do contact the person in the description section below. Now in the Philippines or any part of the world, we need vehicles like this. We need commercial vehicles that we need to uh, deliver our products. We need to sometimes help our friends when they're moving their houses. So in our channel, you say, Shijak. Yeah, I'm about to fade away. Cause every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday. Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain. All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way. Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray. I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay? Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way. I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace. I never really asked to be brought into this place. You wanna love me? Well, then, baby, I have a taste. All the highs and the lows. No, you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you But I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side Maybe we could be okay Okay, okay Maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never fell this way I really hope that you Will choose to stay Through all the pain I know you told your friend You're not okay And tell me what's wrong And why you never said You felt that way most of them were very expensive before that's before this light ace came this one hits the right spot of 570,000 pesos srp now having that said it is really intelligent of toyota to source this vehicle from daihatsu which comes straight from indonesia and they were able to get that great pricing now when you look from the front it does look like the cargo van but when you go to the side and we have a different look this is the toyota light ace drop side that has the same engine as the vios so uh, i'm not really sure of the pulling capacity but uh, i would want to test it out in the future so we may well get the idea if this car can pull that much of cargo but you know here in the philippines people use all kind of vehicles to pull their cargo and move their products such as the e-bikes or e-tricycles or even motorbikes so i think this is a car so it is gonna get the job done as mentioned in my cargo van video uh, i have a detailed walk around with it the only difference i found was there was a button here that you can that has a traction on and off logo but this one doesn't have that but other than that it's the same car now when you open and close this door you know that this is not a chip car it does feel really solid it feels like you are closing a real passenger car because when you have like cars like l300 you don't feel that at all so the tires the rims these are 14s the suspension of uh, multi-link and Macpherson in front all these things are manual even this side mirror the keyhole and this one the great news is that this car's uh, parts and everything the body it is not fabricated here it is directly imported and because those are the things uh, I don't trust the fabrication quality of the body of the philippines as of yet just like the k2500 i really like it because it is sourced directly from korea especially the drop side 4x4 and the dual cab and this one is just that the front has a cute look it's with this huge black bumper very very normal classy classic looking headlight system the washer and this is like one of the uh, more of a private car like feeling of a commercial vehicle that has great look great brand and also good utility uh, and its purpose and function as of now we have one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six so do the math 
okay six and eight 48 about you can put about 46 bottles of this five gallons and i don't know if it's gonna be able to pull this because it has a very small engine yeah. so if you get your fingers caught somewhere you're dead so this one doesn't have the safety but it does have uh, good hooks here that you can use they look they seem to be durable and this rubber fittings like this ones will last longer than the locally sourced uh, the bodies this one here and there's a window now instead of having it all the way open this is the back of the uh, the drop side very nostalgic type of stuff now this is also funny now let's try to put this down okay all right so when you pull this down it goes all the way down but you see they have placed this one <laughs> this is like an afterthought or something yep it is gonna protect the, the body from being scratched and all There's a spare wheel here and the suspension, lift pack and the reverse lamp. This one also feels like an afterthought because you only have one on this side and the muffler that looks like a bazooka. Let's go inside now. Getting inside the light case is easy because you can hold on to this and then get inside like that. This is a five-speed manual transmission. Now, if you want more detail of what's inside here, please do watch my Light Ace cargo van video. It has almost everything the same. Yeah, almost the same. The seat material, this pattern, this plastic. It does look good. And the, the killing, the great point about this car is that we have airbags for the passenger and the driver. And that's rare to see in this kind of cars. Analog everything, this one, the gear lever, five speed, you can do reverse. Yeah, that sound, that's a nice sound. <laughs> and this air condition, everything is quite easy and they don't look like they're gonna break in a while because like L300 for me, it's gonna, it breaks, it literally breaks. So this is gonna take a bit longer time for the workers here to actually destroy this. And it does look too nice for some people to use. Yeah. So thank you everyone for watching this video. Please do contact the person in the description section below if you want to purchase your Toyota vehicles. And this one starts at 570,000 pesos SRP. And with that, I'll see you in the next video. May your dreams come true.